Hi, it's Kerry. Today I'm unboxing a Jurassic World mini dino multi-pack. There's 15 different dinosaurs and on the back it tells you what's in there. It's been three years since the theme park and luxury resort Jurassic World was destroyed by dinosaurs out of containment. Isla Nubla now sits abandoned by humans while the surviving dinosaurs fend for themselves in the jungle. When the island's dormant volcano begins roaring to life, Owen and Claire mount a campaign to rescue the remaining dinosaurs from this extinction level event. Mosasaurus, these apex predators of the prehistoric deep can feast on all manner of ocean life. Their double hinged jaws open wide for any prey, including plesiosaurs and great white sharks. They are not actually dinosaurs, but in fact marine reptiles. There's a few spoilers coming up when I'm adding the dinosaurs to the volcano. It's quite safe to watch the dinosaurs though. Indominus Rex, what an awesome model! At first glance, Indominus Rex looks like a T-Rex but its distinctive head ornamentation and ultra-tough bony osteoderms can be traced from abeliosaurs. Indoraptor bears an eerie but powerful similar appearance to Indominus Rex but it's about three quarters of its size. Sports toe claws that are similar to a Velociraptor's and it's basically a dark black colour with a golden yellow streak from the base of the neck to its tail. It reminds me of Blue's metallic streak. The shape of its head bears a resemblance to a Tyrannosaurus rex's and it has a sprinkled red mark around the eye orbit. Indoraptor also has night vision so it can be a villain day and night. Up bell wings for the spoiler alert and I say okay when it is okay. Barry Onyx is one of the largest fish eating dinosaurs. Its crocodile like head and dangerous claws make it a master hunter of rivers and lakes. Metriacanthosaurus, a fleet footed carnosaur. Metriacanthosaurus is named for its distinctively spined vertebrae. It once stalked the ancient Jurassic plains, feeding on other dinosaurs. Owen is driven to find Blue, his lead raptor who's still missing in the wild and Claire has grown a respect for these creatures, she now makes her mission. Arriving on the unstable island, as lava begins raining down, their expedition uncovers a conspiracy that could return our entire planet to a perilous order, not since prehistoric times. Carnotaurus has a huge muscle between her thigh and tail that allows it to wind up for one extremely powerful kick. The cloned Dilophosaurus has some very unusual traits including a frill, venom glands Allosaurus was the most common predator of the late Jurassic period. Like most meat-eating dinosaurs, its jaws were filled with serrated teeth. Tyrannodon is Jurassic World's biggest pterosaur or flying reptile. With a wider wingspan than any other known bird, it's primarily a fish eater, though Tyrannodon is very aggressive. I think this new movie is going to be more awe-inspiring and terrifying than ever before. In the second half of the film, when the dinosaurs have been captured and rescued, they will be auctioned at the Lockwood Manor, all with the exception of Blue, while the creation of the Indoraptor takes place. Owen, Claire and Maisie attempt to stop the auction before the dinosaurs break out to attack a city five miles away from the Lockwood Manor. Triceratops, very impressive looking head. It used its horns, a short one above its mouth and two long ones above its eyes to charge predators such as T-Rex. The Stegosaurus has 17 bony plates along its spine and a powerful spiked tail. Both could inspire fear 
but were used primarily for protection. This is Stiggy, a type of Pachycephalosaurus. The spikes on the skull prevents predators from trying to bite this dinosaur on the neck. A Patasaurus is a herbivore. The cervical vertebrae of a Patasaurus are less elongated and more heavily constructed than those of Diplodocus. Claire Deering, the former park manager, has now founded the Dinosaur Protection Group, an organisation dedicated to saving and protecting the dinosaurs. Claire recruits Owen Grady, a former dinosaur trainer who worked at the park to help her rescue the remaining dinosaurs. This is going to be such a good movie. Thank you for watching my video. Please share my videos with your friends. See you again soon.